Salutations, Spellbound. Story lovers, this is Automatic for Automatic Games. Thanks for joining me for this, the fourth episode of our Vault 88 Rising series. In our previous installment, Sergeant Ramsey and his Alpha Squad fought their way to Park Street Station in Boston Central. Of course, that houses Vault 114, a vault previously visited by Ray the Overseer. Now, we'll go ahead and pick up our story where we last left off. That movement below. I'll take point. Everyone on me. And of course, when Ray infiltrated this vault, he employed stealth, so there's still numerous trigger men inside. That's wrong. Among them is, of course, Skinny Malone. So needless to say, Alpha Squad will encounter resistance, but as one might expect, Resistance will be met with force. Hey, who the fuck? Give it up. What? Give it up. Fuck it. Frag out. Oh, fuck it. Fall back. Shit. Hold on, boys. clear? I think so. Move up. I'll take point. Right behind you, boy. Copy that. Well, that that was a decent and and quick in, insertion. Boy. Boy. What? Shit. Oh, oh. Frag out. You all right? Yeah. Jesus, man. Ain't nothing phase you? I, I don't know. Shit. It's funny and a little sad that some of these triggermen presume that this is vault Tech come to reclaim their facility. I guess in a twisted way, that's kind of true, but not at all. Move up and find some cover. Yes, yes. Gotta love Baron. What did she say? Get some shit suits? Classy lady. And a good nickname for these fucks. Fuck. Fucking cockmonger. You have two more straight down the hall here. Straight down the top. I got the, uh, I got the left flank. Use those stim packs, folks. Use those stim pack packs. You heard the man. Use the stim packs. Shit. Piece of shit. Bring it up. We're clear. Boy, you stay on this side. Okay. The rest of you, you take the right tunnel. We'll meet you at the junction. Need to at the Johnson. I gotta say, so far so good. 
All hands accounted for. Wake the fuck up, boy. Wake the fuck up, or, or did you say wake? Sir? Friendly ahead. Friendly ahead. Yes, Sarge, are you seeing all these, uh, all these uh, crates? Yeah. Well, we're on the right track. Sure as shit, that's vault -Tec. Yep. Movement ahead, sir. Good eye, Baron. Good eye. It's like two of them. Light him up. Going left. <clears throat> Frag out. Oh shit. All right, squad on me. Would you look at that? Sure shit, that's a vault. You got that right. Alright, Dickweed, stay close. Got people inside. Fucking frag out. Let's go. We clear? No, no, we're not clear. I gotta tell you, as desperate as I am to narrate this piece, uh, I, I don't want to talk all over the squad banter. Oh. Shit. All right, Ham, keep point. We'll do. Stay frosty in there. Cause, cause frankly, I, I kind of enjoy it. Um. So yeah, especially when they're talking, I'm gonna keep quiet. Or even when they're not talking, what the hell? What are these guys? Fucking mafia? Anyone else feeling like gangbusters? I know I am. Shit. Fuck. All right. Yeah, I'm fine. I think you hit my soup. Your what? My soup. I've got soup in the back. Oh, okay. I'll take point. Okay. <laughs> Memphis Bell, anyone? Thank God for the soup. Movement. Looks like two of them. Move on to the Hey, um, you, you got any extra stimp hats? 
Yeah, I got step backs, man. Step backs for days. Cam, of course, is a carryover from XCOM. And once again, he's serving as squad medic. Hands up. Watch out, Valdez. Shit. I'm okay, I'm okay. Meanwhile, Valdez, he's kind of like the second command. Squad corporal, if you will. Going for the flank, going for the flank. Eat shit, sucker. How we doing? All right, bring it up. We're clear. Okay. Watch the hole. You can get through that. No watch your step sign? That's fucking hazardous. I don't think safety's a priority with these folks. Alright, gents. I'll see you in hell. Going down. Oh. Shit. You alright? <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> He only face planted against that wall. I mean, it is a two story drop. A little clumsiness is to be expected. Well, they, they got a Braxo. Could use that. Yeah, a, a Braxo is always a good thing. The vault could use that, especially the well-preserved stuff, not the uh, not the cake, the caked-up bleach. Hey guys, what's going on? Down below. I got you. Frag out. Fucking grenades you got. It's like shit and fish in a barrel. Yeah, if only we're that easy. Clear. Clear. Yeah, we clear. All right. Who brings a baseball bat to a gunfight? Really, I thought these guys were trigger men. <laughs> That's a fair point by Boyd. I, I don't know if they've earned the name trigger men. Let's bring it in, boys. <laughs> There's vault tech backpacks. Looks like, uh, we just scored ourselves some new backpacks. Vault Tech issued backpacks. Ooh, I want a new backpack. Yeah, we don't have these at our vault. You'll get one. Everyone's gonna get one. Thank God. And so, yeah, it's obvious I've, I've partaken into the, uh, the Creation Club. Here we go. Overseer. Do you want us to start hacking this? I want that terminal hacked. You're looking for inventories. 
Look, same fucking thing with this one in here. Benton, you'll get the one inside. And that's it. I mean, they've, they've got to find out what this vault has for them to take back. And they'll be using, you know, three or four of those big orange carts to, to roll shit back. And stuff in their backpacks, old and new, with as much gear as they can carry. We probably won't show that episode. Okay, Benton. Show me what you got. I don't see nothing. Everyone else, get cozy. Somebody watch the door, though. Looks like this place was barely stopped. It's still under construction, sir. Yeah. What? Some files I can't get to. Well, shit. What are you doing? He said get cozy. Yeah, this place sure wasn't finished. Here's the plans. The guy that was doing the hacking, Benton, uh, he, he doesn't talk much, but nonetheless is a, is a valuable member of Alpha Squad. Come to think of it, Ham doesn't talk a whole lot either. Everyone else does. Get off the fucking chair. Hmm? Benton, get off the chair. Why? Benton, are you deaf? Set, get comfortable. Okay. How is that comfortable? What do you know about this? Anything is mostly cleaning supplies. Do they have construction gear? Lots of parts, so uh, no gold mine. That's for sure. Vault deck suits. Uh, the aforementioned backpacks. Fuck. Well, we'll take what we can get. All right, boys, we're rolling out. So you, is this all for nothing or what? I don't know. There's a fair amount of replacement parts, which we could definitely use. I doubt that was the end of uh, the Trigger Man, so we'll keep it frosty. Your eyes peeled. Yes, sir. Of course, Ramsey's not going to forget those new backpacks. It's it's kind of handy to have two backpacks. Well, like I alluded to earlier, it just means you can carry more shit back to Vault 88. Backpacks for everyone. I know I want one. Backpacks. Stick to yourself. Mine's got a bolt on it. Oh, we don't need them, but it'll make Bravo jealous. That's true. <laughs> Truth be told, they're gonna bring back enough backpacks that Bravo Squad's gonna get some too. Much to Alpha Squad's chagrin. Perhaps they should have only taken six. And in fact, Ramsey did, but when they make their big haul, they're gonna bring back uh, more than that. I don't know if anybody said it, but there are more stairs in here. In fact, Nick Valentine says it in the main story, Valdez. But you wouldn't know that, of course. Ooh, clean pillows. Those will come in handy. Score.
Hell yeah, Jim will be glad to see another magazine. If not Jim, Clem will sure take it. Though to be honest, I don't I don't want to give anything to Clem. Let's get up there. Go, go, go. You know, I think I prefer our vault. Yeah, you think? Oops. Let's cut the chatter. Sorry, sir. And I am conscious of the fact that of my handful of impressions, uh, my voice is closest to Ramsey's. Yes, sir. Well, Uncle, it's your lucky day. And I hope that doesn't serve as too much of a distraction. I hope you don't have a problem making a distinction of when I'm narrating and when Ramsey is talking. Kind of worried about that. In the hall, on the right. Frag out. You went out, bitching. Now you probably noticed that Ramsey picked up that, uh, what was it, a bottle of wine? Um, of course, that's for Uncle. Uncle asked for wine and cigarettes. And so Ramsey, I guess, is going to oblige him. Our ball suits. It's good to have options. So we're going to come back through this place and pick up some of this shit? Lamps. Yeah, what do you think? We're just going to leave. Of course. And I tell you, this this is really a departure from from going through uh, a, a dungeon, quote unquote, alone as a sole survivor. Can we account for their boss or what? Well, somewhere among the dead, hopefully, we would find a Skinny Malone. This clearly is not Skinny Malone. I would assume that Skinny is well. Skinny. Irony could be a thing. <laughs> so even if we didn't get him, yeah, at least we cleared out his fucking ball. Little does Ramsey know, as Boyd said, irony is a thing with Skinny Malone, and of course, that guy over there is, in fact, the dead Skinny Malone. So yeah, they got him. They just don't know it. But yeah, going going through this uh, this particular vault as a squad, I was kind of worried about it. Worried about what viewers would think. Um, of course, I'm doing it for story's sake. And frankly, I, I think it's kind of fun. I'm enjoying it. You gotta watch the friendly fire, though. Especially with no rectangle. Bingo. Well, Uncle, I told you I'd keep my eyes peeled. Your ass owes me one. Anyways, I hope you're enjoying it as well. Sure, you're already aware that 114 was under construction. That being the case, there ain't a whole hell of a lot to, to bring back. But what we did score, we'll be able to haul using some of these carts that are scattered around here. In terms of the trigger men and, and a survivor left in this vault, of course, there's no way of telling whether or not we got Skinny Malone, but then again, I, I don't know if that was a priority for Alpha Squad or not. Over. Well, I, I've met the man, and in a Commonwealth short, one Skinny Malone would be better for it. 
It's just a shame there's no way to confirm or deny his fate without my being there. Over. I, I didn't know we concerned ourselves with the well-being of the Commonwealth. I figured, I figured our Minuteman days were long past. Over. Well, the Minuteman may be a finished thing, but our selfishness can't continue for long. Isolationism is not the answer, over. Yes, sir, over. I, uh, is that, is that singing I hear in the background, over? Ah, uh, yeah. Well, I apologize about that. Uh, we just figured since the zone was clear, there'd be no harm in it, but, uh, you know, usually I shut them down as soon as they start, but they seem to be enjoying themselves, over. Well, then by all means, let them carry on. They certainly earned it, over. I, I agree wholeheartedly, sir. They they did earn it. Everyone fought with valor and distinction, and I'm pleased to be their squad leader. Over. And I, too, am pleased, pleased to, to be your overseer and pleased to report this to the community. Let your men know that, over. Will do, sir. Uh, uh, they'll be thrilled to hear that. Thank you very kindly, over. No, Sergeant. Thank you. What you have done there at 114 will better our community for some time to come. These supplies are vital for our survival, and, and you have the gratitude of a, of a community back here at Vault 88 who, who looks forward to your return. 88 OS over and out. Yes, sir. Alpha Leader, out. I'd warn you all that your singing might attract attention, but to be frank, it'll probably scare those assholes off. I'll just say that. Well done, folks. Well fucking done. Are you talking about the song or the, the action? He's talking about the action, but I told you the song, we did good, we did good. <laughs> what you laughing for? I'm fixing to make us the vault choir. You want my advice? Stick to the loyalty core. Leave the tunes to the vault PA system. What is a banana anyways? Does anybody know? I'm pretty sure it's a boat. A banana boat? Ain't that right? Well, folks, uh, that'll do it for this episode. Thanks for joining me. This is Automatic for Automatic Games. I appreciate you watching. If you like this, like this. And if you are subscribed, I will talk to you soon, friends.